Man, that ship is nice. Like, I like the design for the rover, but... The ship design is really nice, too. Ryder, could we talk a moment? Sure thing, Kahlo. Sam's been compiling our star charts. The other pilots on the Nexus will have plenty of new trails to follow. Great. You can drop the charts off the next time we're there. Funny. A few months ago, that station was like a war zone. We were just there. You could have dropped them off. Now it's become a haven, just as it was meant to be. They could use a lake like the Citadel. Every good space station needs a big lake. Maybe some fountains. Indeed. Even non-amphibians need a little water. Regardless, the worst threat to the whole initiative is still that monstrosity. You mean the Scourge? I still see it crippling the Nexus in my memories. I had to train other pilots in hazardous flight techniques just to look for food and water. It's a cage that eats good ships and good people. Helios won't be home so long as it's a threat. Yeah, I'm not seeing any way to eliminate the Scourge. We just have to kind of cope with it. It's a huge space anomaly. It's not going away in anyone's lifetime. If we could somehow neutralize it, or if our ships had defenses against it. Still, that's what we do, isn't it? Find a way where there is none. Just see the Nexus for proof of that. Oh, hey, Philosopher. Doing fine. Um, so we're getting to supposedly one of the more bugged quests, or for an animation standpoint. The... Perfect drift. <laughs> also limbs and lives. Well, what's the point of having them then? Alright, the movie night. I got, I got a copy of the Nexus's movie library. Thanks. I'll look through it. It's probably all agricultural learning vids, but there might be something good. I'll keep you posted. Oh, that's it. So, we'll probably guess, uh... Checkpoint or something on that later. Alright. Hold, so. We've got Korra's mission next, then. Okay, so I guess I oversold the bugging animation issues, but apparently Movie Night has some animation problems when we actually have the Movie Night. But hopefully they've fixed those. We've got a few patches since then. All right. Again, I'll lend you thirty if you pay me back by tomorrow. Done. Thank you, Subi. Someday I'll find out why you're always strapped for credits. Probably he's in the poker game. That's why he's strapped for credits. All right. Firefighters is on hold. System is mapped. On to Eos. Clues on the Asari Arc. Yeah. yeah. Liam's character model is really good. So it looks like now our default landing zone is Pedromos, which is fine. Don't 
put me on with Korra, because we need her for this mission. Right, let's do Drac. <clears throat> uh, since we met Drac here. Actually, let's do PB, since we had some meeting with Morisari. Um, we haven't had much chances for PB to interact with other Asari yet. Um, oh, Drac, Drac's fun. Symbols, and I have a new consumable slot. Back of life support for there. Coordinating. Path is calm. Hopefully a few more areas of the planet will have become hospitable by the time we've arrived here. With the Nexus having had some time to do some... Well, Nexus, but the Vault having had some time to do some work. Yeah, straight into cutscene. Back where we really started. What's new on our first home? The cats still maintain a presence. Skirmishes are free. Ah, we have a cat stronghold now. They never learn. What else? The atmosphere continues to clear, but radioactive hazards fall in some areas. Study is ongoing. And remnant remain active on the surface, but also as detected by seismic readings. Point of contact for all this? Your people, Pathfinder. Protoromos is expanding, with all the trials and discoveries that building an outpost represents. Grounded in research. All data about newly accessible EOS is from their work. Well, let's make sure it gets the attention it deserves. Alright, so now we got a kid out. So now we have a kit outpost we can attack now. That is actually really nice to hear. So there's things we can do to help clear things up, expand here. Speaking of a lake... So let's find out about the... Uh, Ah, uh, sorry. New pistol barrel. That's more omni gel. Armed and armored. Good for you. I could have used that ordinance a few weeks ago. I'm Ryder, the human pathfinder. Lieutenant Harper. We're looking for the Asari Ark. So am I. Watching the skies every day, praying I survived the cat. At least you and these others made it out. Only just. Our clothes were still smoldering. What happened? The cat chased our Ark across the cluster. But these weren't their regular soldiers. They were hunters. Elite killers. Huh. Why are they sending the elite troops? Did you have being hunted by an elite anything isn't fun? What were they after? I don't know. I'm a junior. I just do what they tell me. A bridge officer, Sarissa something, gave the evacuation order. Hundreds of people, all trying to flee. It, w it was. Where could we look for the Ark? We lost track. But they launched a ship to help evacuees, and her crew would know. You'd have to find her. Follow the transponder, maybe. Consider it done. Focus on taking care of yourselves. The ship's called the Parafona. I'll give you her transponder codes and last That's a good place to start. Thank you. 
Thank you. It's, it's good, to good to see the cat aren't the only ones winning. All right, so Vold, we're actually we're actually heading back there. Oh, oh boy. Terminal and E. I've already gone through the quest before. Alright. In the meantime, we have a couple of side quests here. Let's do this one. Uh, this one first. And drop point. More drop points over there. When we hit up that way, we'll probably start clearing things up for, uh... Other side quests. Well, hey. Still think you'd be better off with soldiers at your outpost. I got the cat outpost... Cat, uh, re... Oh, this one's closer. Let's do this one first. Done a couple side quests and Ah, Pathfinder. I hear you're to thank for a physics defying atmosphere process. Something like that. That's me. That's me. I'm Ryder. Haley Abrams is director of scientific research on EOS and writer of papers in Star What the Hell Weather. <laughs> new galaxy, new world, and a really new start. Gotta keep up. How can I help you? Well, the question is, how can I help you? Act activating that vault changed the planet. Anything to worry about? Looking at data from the other outposts, whatever these vaults are doing seems to be permanent and beneficial so far. But the storms show no signs of returning, and I know who to contact for remnant tech support. I'll take it. What kind of research are you working on? Your basic first in scientific work, soil, water, atmospherics, plus studying remnant tech, because now I need to understand that to survive here. What do you make of Lieutenant Bradley? Determined as hell, and he has incredible faith in us to get this done. Bradley would carry this outpost on his back if he had to, and we'll make sure he never has to. Alright. I've gotta go. Keep up the good work. You have a quest marker over your head. There. Did you feel that tremor? We've been tracking major seismic activity lately. But I don't know what's causing it. Something strange is going on out there. I have a guess. It's another one of those big monsters. Something? A volcano or something? I'm guessing a remnant something? That might help us. Eos has massive underground rivers we can't tap. But altering those tremors just right might crack the ground for irrigation. Our seismic survey hammers would be perfect. All I need is someone to place them. Um, please? What's a seismic survey hammer? Fox built them. They punch like a dozen Krogan and cause vibrational changes underground. <laughs> the hammers give good geophysics data. Honestly, they're just fun. Alrighty then. You got it. Just tell me where to go. I've worked out the areas where the tremors seem centered. Trigger the hammers there. Just be careful. The tremors are getting worse. Anything else Speaking of which... So, there was no auditory cue for that, but there was a force feedback cue in the controller for when that happened. Keep up the good work. So, that was a nice touch. That one, I may, Cora, swap you out for... Um... for one of the other characters with some ranged weapons because we're going to need some major <laughs> heavy firepower if we're dealing with another one of those uh, remnant architects. Pathfinder. Quest on the terminal. Okay. Jerry O'Donnell. Interesting. Uh, 
Nav points have lost supplies, noted Pathfinder. Not busting our tails and viability to let resources go so easy. Let's check it out. And the last one to ch Last quest marker. Over this way. Right there, with the console. Alright, lost drones. Okay. Eh. This has the camera stuff first. Fast travel to here, because it gets me going a little faster. Okay, actually, no, let's leave Core on board and see how this goes. If it turns out... If it turns out that we need, um... Some little bit more heavy weapons to take on this mission... been in there and I think I already scanned it. Yeah, I already killed all the cat in here. Last time I was on EOS. The problem to do a scan, it probably wouldn't hurt to do a scan again. So, nothing. I was hoping that we'd, like, be have a different party mem party selection and we get more s information out of it. Hey! Radiation level's still fine. Bane of Masani. Any relation to Zaid? The sheer top, because it is. I guess you run out of names eventually. All right. First things first. Forward supply drop. Activating automated forward station deployment. My zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added Let's place the seismic hammer. In 50 years, this could be a beach vacation. Oh, it's a bunch of remnant stuff. Let's say hi. 
Remnant and Scourge. A Scourge site is nearby Pathfinder. Remnant activity may be unstable. Drop the drop the observer first because those next to the thing pain in the ass. Everybody, what's everything? Hemo. Courage, energy pockets. Okay. Oh, shoot. Oh, wow. We, um, survived that. <laughs> oh, that was close. Oh, wow. Let's try this again, shall we? Uh, let's play at the right point next to the one I'm trying to get to. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. Yeah. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Here we go. Lot more, lots of iron. Lots and lots of iron. Well, not lots of iron, but a bunch of iron. Hey, that is a cat outpost. What is these things? We've had a bunch of them on Vold, too. Get up here to have left. I wonder if we won't support weren't supposed to do Vold first. And a bunch of aluminum. the container, I guess. All right, back in the car. Uh, yes, I know. This area can be mined for resources. Interface. Yeah, now I'm heading in the right direction.
Let's try not to Dukes of Hazard our way back to the base. That would kind of go bad. Planet after planet wears tech down in different ways. I usually end up walking. We're outfitted best we can be. Gil has tuned the Nomad perfectly for EOS. So this is still showing as white here, which means there's still something here I haven't discovered yet. Some Ezo. Maybe not. Okay, let's keep moving then. The one down there. Uh, yes, I know. You mine for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Iron and whatever the hell this is. Vanadium. See, we got. Wow, holy cow. Um This is mother load. Like you have two mods, one of which we have a mod that gives you more mods. <laughs> um so this game is not exactly uh <laughs> uh I mean that there are classes, but it's not exactly class limited. I am using a Vanguard profile but I have unlocked a whole bunch of other profiles. Um, I already unlocked the Explorer profile. I haven't unlocked an Infiltrator yet. Um, but there's... You can basically pop through them more or less at will. Alright. A lot of good stuff around here. Not all loot, but a bunch of good stuff. A mod that gives you an extra mod slot. <laughs> an extra mod slot, basically. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, Navi. We have... More iron. Looks like we have some scavenger animals on our lost supply crates. Do I scan these before already?
Oh, that works. Quick mess to clean up. Not getting any of the supplies back this way, though. And organic crafting materials. Sam, Sam, are you sure about this? Yes, Pathfinder. The crates were opened using standard protocols. It's unlikely the local fauna could have accomplished this. They're bugs, Sam. They didn't do it. More data is required to be definitive, Pathfinder. You're a real machine sometimes, Sam. Alright, so, not the bugs. Place the first seismic hammer. Strange how bleeding for a place makes it feel worthwhile. Our people came a long way. Nothing here will stop them. The sky is beautiful in its own way. Oh, hi, Kit. Oh, you are all close together, so... Stick your head up, say hi. Thank you. Let's see what you dropped. Ah, brood receiver with a sniper rifle. Nice. This looks a lot like a vault entrance. Like, active... What's shooting at me? Sambor over there. Hey, that's my cover. Second wave. yet. Tech, I now have Remnant VI. Alright. Let's just reload combat fitness a little bit further. And ha! Extra holster, which is what I'm looking for. Alright, Sentinel Perk is on. No profile is unlocked. And Infiltrator is unlocked. Alright. And Cora, I can put some points into defensive training to make her more survivable. And Drac isn't quite half level yet, so. Uh, back to the car, probably could have parked closer, but then I've got to get shot more on the way in. Alright. Let's meet the Ketsbane character. So that is... 
Please way down there. Um, let's stick on this side of the map first. There's the way down. This looks like a crater. And there's another sort of um, scourge contaminated remnant area.